Hey there guys, Hydra here and welcome to episode 3 of season 2 of Terror Attack. Um, I decided to actually play a bit in advance in between episodes so we can progress faster so we can actually do more in the episode. Uh, because at the pace we were going at episode 1 and 2 we might just be, um, well, you guys know how far we went at season 1. So I, I don't want to be like episode 12 where I finally get... Uh, caught up with season one because I want to be, be uh, pushing through stuff. I want to show you guys new things and I don't want to take 10 episodes out of 20 um, to actually get back on par with season one. So that's why I did a lot of stuff today for you guys. So first off, we have our new battle thing. Um, it's, it's not the prettiest thing I ever made, but it works actually. And um, things I found were uh, our Uzi gun. On top here, the, the machine gun thing. Uh, I found the tank wheels. I found... Uh, well, that's pretty much it. All the new things on the car. What I did do, though, was create this. And over here, we have five refineries. And there's stuff coming in here on these uh, receivers. And they are going around in a circle over here until they are going through the uh, refinery and they will pop up on the other side. So, and then they just go on a conveyor all the way over there and they store up in these, um, what are they called, tractor pads and the trading station eats them. Um, this is just something I wanted to try. I am pretty sure that the um, returning cannons can do the same as the trading station, but I just wanted to use it uh, as, a as a check, as a test to see how far it can go. So, um, this is our monster right now. We might just want to charge up a bit. Because, oh, uh, why not? And I also leveled up to level 2. And now we have a new quest. Find the harvest boss and kill it. I have no clue how strong it is. Or how big it is. Or how mean it is, actually. So, I want to... FPS lag. A little bit of lag spike there. Um, so, I wanted to show you guys. And... Um, what the dude is, I have no idea as well. So we're just going to find that out. Go away, stupid tree. There we go. Also put uh, two turbines on each side just to push it forward a bit more. Because it is a bit slow unless it has speed. So then it goes pretty, pretty damn quick. Yeah. So Mr. Harvest Boss, okay, let's first molest you. Die, potato. I do have a feeling my sound is pretty loud, so I'm going to adjust that a bit. Just give me one second. So there we go. Um, yeah, so that's the Harvest Boss over there. Looks a bit mean though. That's the Harvest Boss I had. I hope he has new stuff. I'm just... Frick. Oh, what's the cannon doing over there? Cannon? Why don't you come with me? Mm, nope. I'm just going to touch you in the back. Alright, so first off, let's just make sure that we are not stuck. Alright, little trick. Boom. There we go. That'll do. Why aren't we putting this one a bit higher and this one as well? How is this doing it? Oh, that's pretty cool, actually. Alright, let's keep it this way. We're shooting downwards now, though. Uh, yeah, there we go. Hello, Mr. Harvest Boss. This works. Boom! Yeah, yeah. <gasps> nice, we have generators. So we have access to the three block. We have all these already. So like we <gasps> Wow, look at this, dude. Guys, look at that. This is a grade three, grade two fabricator. So two materials and one ending product. product. Looks pathetically cool though. Wow. Oh, nice. Generator, finally. Battery, battery, battery. Even more batteries. And we finally found our four slot tractor pad. Cool. 
So, great catch here. And there's something new here as well. No, that's just a refinery. Oh, so cool. I love these uh, crafters now though. Look at them, the fabricators. Nice. I have no clue what the recipes are, but we are going to find that out really soon. Um, do we have a filter yet? No, no filter. Shit, I want my filter. I really want that filter though. Uh, what else do we need from this? What's over there? Nothing, nothing, nothing. All right, so that's it. We're just going to take this with us. I don't know why, but we're just doing it. Return fabricator to solar generator. Well, let's do that then. Her. So apparently there's a grade two. I've seen grade five as well. So there are massive fabricators now in the game. And I love that concept. I really do. I mean, you can pretty much make anything you want now. And with the filters, you can pretty much create pretty big item storages. Uh, with silos where you can just filter away like um, all this green stuff I s I'm still a bit unfamiliar with the names of the minerals even though I played like ages um, so yeah uh, plumbia all that kind of shit you can just filter it out uh, refine it first then filter it out and make one giant storage so you can just grab them put them pop them on a uh, fabricator and make everything you want that's like the best concept you can get in this game it's pretty perfect because it suits the game perfectly and that's what I like about this I mean these developers are just thinking about this uh, in a way where they do not overthink it but they do not miss like tiny details as well so it's actually pretty pretty cool development team oh, what's in there guys is there stuff in the back alrighty then what about that oh there's stuff yes boop, 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 boop. Hidden storage. Nice, I like it. So popping you back in there. Come on, you little douche. There you go. Come on, there. So now what do we have and what do we need? Oh, by the way, look at this, how this works. So all the raw materials go in this uh, first circle and then they just keep rotating until the uh, refineries are pretty much uh, refining it. And then they go past here, over there. And then we have this principle um, where everything is pretty much going into these tractor pads and they are being transferred over to the trading station. So again, cool concept. Um, I love it. So what are we going to do? We have another refinery. You can just pop it over there. We're just going to make sure that we have four more uh, conveyors over there. So we can just do that right now. I mean, also the blocks are really cheap. Um, here you have like wheels for 75, 83 for a, a conveyor, and then there's 1k for a fabricator. So that's like, hello, difference. We have a silo. How did we get a silo? I want silos. Give me two silos. What else do we have? All right, right. Did I get that with the um, level up? I don't know, actually. There we go. Oh wait, I broke it. I broke it. So the thing with these conveyors these days is that you can pretty much um, build them next to each other and they will form a line and they will form a circle. And once you right mouse button them, then they, the circle will flip or you can just do something like this where you um, have a purple line which is a split. And uh, what you can do, can I do this? I don't know, can I? Here. I don't know actually, what do we do with this? Can we pop this in there and see what happens? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's just pop the silos over there because they are actually useful now. With this whole new system of uh, things that just have been happening, system of things. Best English ever. So now we have over here, the fabricator mm -hmm. and we need four more let's just get some conveyors there uh, blah, blah. conveyors somewhere here there one two the negative side on the building next to a trading station is that the um oh no i don't want this i want it to go like that all right let's just see what's happening uh-huh. 
Uh -huh. Alright, let's just pop this one over here then. So there's a bit of a thing with these conveyors still where you um, need to put them in a certain order to actually get the circle up and running. Uh, where is my... Hmm, I lost it somewhere. Doesn't matter, we just get two more. There. So yeah, like I said, the negative side of having uh, blocks near the train station is that the blocks you want to buy don't really spawn there. Like, I can buy three blocks over here, but they will only spawn two because I've built too close to the trading station. Let's just show you. And there's one, that's two, and that's a three. And they will only spawn two. Because a third one should be spawning there, but it won't because there's blocks I built nearby. So, that's still a bit of a thing. We at least enhanced this now, and now we just need... Hmm, Make this a bit more symmetric because of reasons. There you go. That looks cool. Hmm. This fabricator will be powered by the solar generator. Doesn't know. You can use the fa Stop throwing stuff on my face. Alright. Um, let's just pop this little baby over here. How about over here? There we go, and now we can just power it with one of the solar arrays we have. Where is one? Oh, there are... Eh. There's one. And just pop that in uh, there. Oh, shit balls. Go away. Alright, sometimes this camera is still a bit wobbly. Let's matter though, we got this shit. There. It is powered, but just not at the moment. Is that a problem? Right, let's just pop a uh, generator or a battery next to it. And now, what do they want? I have way too many batteries at the moment. Let's just make one battery tower over here and just pick them up there when we need one. There we go. And now we have these conveyors. All right, so. We want a conveyor over there. We want a conveyor over there. And I think they want us to build a conveyor over there as well. And then just toss this thing in over there. Hmm. We don't really have a bit, bit of a choice over there. Like, we can only do this. Alright. Oh, that's fine, by the way. Let's just pop it in there. Toss it. That'll do. And now all we need is to get rid of these. Um, let's just pop them. Uh, yeah, we don't really need them anymore. So, eh. Let's just see what happens if we do something like that. One on the side, another one on the side. Come on. Just do it. That's a good boy. Get rid of the tank wheel. We can just pop that over there. And we don't need this one at the moment as well. Because then we can just pop this one over there. Because it's... I think it's just a lot better. Um, let's just sell the tank wheel. I said sell it. Thank you. Open you over there. There. And another one. And we just need another one of these 2x2 two two thingies. Where are they? Where are they? Um. Hello? Four pack silo. Where is it? Oh, there you are. Flat bat isn't really expensive as well. Uh, let me just pop, pop you over there. There we go. Perfect. Now we're just stealing three batteries. That'll do. There we go. And we finally have a generator now as well. Ah, perfect. And just let pop you over there. Whatever. Get rid of you. Pop you in the middle. Nice. So now we can finally be self-efficient. 
Let's just see if we can get her some trees, get her some wood. Whoa, 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 whoa. And is it doing it? Yeah, it's working. Perfect. It's a little bit messy though with the textures on the left there. And there you go. Bonk, 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 bonk. Wow. Harvest bus return fabricated to solar array. Solar generator. This is a solar generator. Yeah, so why aren't you working? Oh, cool. Well, that's new. So what if we toss this one over there and grab a wood and pop it in there as well? It doesn't do wood. Yeah, it doesn't do wood yet. We need to... Rubber. Let's just see. With Columbia. Okay. Nothing to do with these as well. All right. There we go. Popping you and you. Now we need to gather some metals and see what we can do with it. Hmm. Is there any metal over here? Look empty. Oh, there's a red one in the back. Okay, let's go. I believe this is a red one, though. Nope, it wasn't. There's nothing in there. There's dark blue over there and two on the right. Let's go. Cool. Something on the back there. Don't think so. All right, let's just see what we can do with this. I think this thing wants me to actually get it on here. I don't know. There's this thingy. What does that give? Let's find it out. Alrighty then. All kinds of. Uh, oh, it's also needed for the gun. Oh, I never knew that. Let's go. Where's the blue crystal? I want the blue crystal. Craft it for me. Yes, that's a good boy. There we go. Bonk. There, so this one can make a drill, cannon, the corner. Oh, two of titanium makes a corner. And these things are actually really tough. And armored as well, so that's cool. That's cool. I like it. Nice, you've arrived. All right, and let's just pop you on there. Are you happy now? Oh, nice. Undo. Perfect. So I just want us to explore more and more and more. Yeah. So I'm wondering, what else should we achieve right now? I mean, we've done a lot already. I've showed you guys a lot already. So we might as well just make... We need, we actually need to find some more um, blocks. So I'm just going to see if I can um, figure out to get to the blue plains to the salt plains because that's pretty much the place where most of the uh, new blocks are hidden and i believe it's over there so let's just see what it can do for us um what do you have nothing what i need oh look at you i'm going to kill you i think don't be too, don't be too rough on me, please. Be gentle. Oh, that one looks actually, looks really cool. Maybe it has some new blocks for us. Nice. Stop. You are pretty damn strong, though. 
Grapple it. What's it doing? Look, mom, I can do a trick. And he dead. Please don't destroy everything. I at least want to touch these. Oh, I'm just going to bring these with me. What about that? Might be cool. There we go. Need to be a bit heavy now, though. Nah. 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 Doesn't matter. We need these blocks. Eventually. And they are pretty pricey, so let's just take them with us. Hmm. So I wonder where the blue planes are. Uh, the salt ones. I thought they would be around here somewhere. Maybe over the trees and far away. Somewhere in the back over there. There's something big there though. What are you? Oh damn. Oh shit. This thing is mean. The stinger, yeah, he stings, bruh. Oh well. I thought you would be dead now. Well, you are pretty much dead right now. Oh dear. What's exploding? Go away. Go away. No! Goodbye! Well, that's cool. That's perfect. That's fucking fantastic. Ugh. So good thing I possess magic because then I can just do this. And now we just have a car. So. I tried to save as many things as I could, but as you can see, I kind of screwed some things over, like all our batteries are gone. Uh, yeah, these things happen. They just tend to happen. We don't have a radar now as well, I see. That's not really a thing, so. I always tend to go for Geocorp in the end. That's just what this shows. <laughs> oh wow, I promised you guys that I wouldn't go Geocorp, and now I build a Geocorp. My bad. Doesn't matter though, because they are, for me at least, the best playable kind of machines in the game. Don't you fucking dare. Go away. Oh, by the way, these tractor pads can now carry items. I'm not sure if they could do that in the older versions, but um, with the new changes, um, with 0, 5, 12, and 13, they changed that the bigger um, receivers could actually pick up items. And now they cannot do that anymore. But these tractor pads can actually carry items. So you can, you can just drop them on there. And they will carry the items for you. Which is something different as well, I believe. So that's cool. That's good. What's up? Ow. Oh, damn. All right, so from a tractor pad, they can actually pick up items, uh, these receivers, and they can put them on the circulation and nothing is going wrong. That's pretty cool. All right, I need a battery now because I want one. We're going to pop it in the back somewhere. How about there? Go in there. Never mind then. Let me just pop you there next to this one. There, perfect. And now, what do we have? We have a lot of stuff in here. We also have a lot of shields, as you can see. Wow. So these things take away everything. All right, so they can only pick one resource, the silos. One small stack, yeah, there you go. So you can just pretty much filter out one resource. Uh, put one resource in a silo and then it will just grab it whenever it comes by and it will save it from going into the receiver or into the trade oh my bad into the training station hmm so that's pretty interesting so what can we do with that it's actually really cool we can and we could do something like this get rid of these Get all of them sold because we don't really need those things. And then we can just pop back these. 
There we go. And now we're going to mine just a few stones, a few ores, a few metals, a few everything. Uh, yeah, that might actually work. Some kind of an early filter system. If my theory is correct, obviously. Wow. Shooting over everything. Hello. Taking you with me. Right, 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 right. So let's just see if this works. I'm just going to pop you in there. And then you're going to be refined. Yeah, just hurry up. There. Go in there. Bonk. And now we have the Oliet or something. What's the thing called? I'm just going to pop you up there. I'm going to get rid of you. Because no one likes you. And we're going to pop you up there as well. So now we need one, two, three, four, a few more silos. Let's just see if this works. There are blocks, silo. There. It's not that expensive as well. There. One. Two. Let's just get eight or something. We have enough money, so that's not really a problem. Tossing you on the other side, and we want two more. So instead of just filtering out certain metals uh, early game, we're just going to see if we can restrict these silos to certain metals, and once they pass by, they just eat them. So now we just need every different, every different kind of metal in the game, or at least find a few of them. Um, I saw a lot on the mountains here. There's teal. We might as well just grab one of each resource, so we can also just get wood. Oh, oh, ah. There, that's one, at least. That means my guns are really high or something, I don't understand we're just going to pop you down a bit you as well and you as well how's that is that better i don't know there's more two over there and there's a machine um grab it all these things can carry so much more. That's amazing, actually. Oh, I want the blue one as well. Oh crap, it's eating the black minerals because it's some kind of a fuel. Ah! What the hell happened? Stop doing that. Stop throwing yourself away. That's one of the most common things in the game, like throwing yourself around, like, Wah! do a barrel roll. It's so silly. Hello. Need to park up front, please. Ah, bonk. I know we just gotta pay attention a bit. There's number one. We're going to pop you in there. So I believe these things can carry ten. Is it? Is it ten? A single stack of small blocks. What's a single stack? Really curious about that. But if everything goes right, then it will either go to this one or to the one existing. Yeah, there we go. And now this one will pop to the side. Oh, this is going to be amazing. Nice. So at, we just got to make sure that all eight of them have one resource in them, which isn't a double one. Because then all the um, exceeding resources will just go through through the trading station and we'll be fine. So there's that, there's the black one. Oh wait, my I, I think my uh, camera's over there, my bad. Let's just look at, look at it from this side. Sorry about that, I just hope that I'm, my, my face is not in the way. Yeah, it looks like this. So all the resources come in here and you can just pop them in here and they will stack up 
Rhodius capsules. There may be weapon applications for deception in the future. All right. And now we can simply just get these things in there. And if we ever want to craft something, we just get one of these capsules, pop them in here, and see what we can create out of it. What's that? Static. What? All right, let's just create one of these. I don't know what it is. It was pretty much unreadable. Let's just check it out. What is it? What are you? Burr. Static delivery cannon. Oh, that looks pretty cool, though. Delivery cannon, someone on his back earning, huh? This one is just static. It will only work whilst anchored and supplied with extra power. Alrighty, then. Will it also, like, get you more? Can we just shoot away items? Oh, there they go. Goodbye. All right, so we can just shoot away items we don't really want to keep. Nice, 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 nice. Why is this game so amazing, honestly? So we can actually now pop this over there. We don't really need it at the moment. So what else we got? We can just pop one of these, the black ones. Let's just grab one of the black ones and pop them in there. What can we create out of that? Oh, we can actually make a generator. Let's just do that. Let's just make one or two generators. Because it's free anyways now, isn't it? There. There. Let's create another one. And just one. Where is it? Where is it? Huh. What? Oh, it's over there. Come here. Come here. So now we have more generators. That's cool. Uh, you should go in there, though. That's a good boy. And yet another generator. So now we have enough generators, I think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we do. And there we go. We're just going to pop these generators in there, do we? No, we're just going to pop them over there. Because we, we don't need them at this moment. We might just make something enormous later on. And we, we need generators for it. But for now, let's just see. Um, so yeah, this system actually works. It's really cool. Now we have this early game filtering system. Just pop you up there and pop you up there as well. Oh, there. So that's a way to filter things. I mean, we have the not we don't have the filter yet, but we we could actually make some kind of a factory with this. Um, but it's more like manual. If you want to do it automatically, you need a filter, and that's going to be freaking amazing, though, because you can just pop a uh, fabricator on the on the back of a, a long conveyor chain, along with a filter in between, where you can just filter out like you want to say you want to make wheels. You just get uh, plumbia and you get uh, rubber, and you filter them out, and you just pop them in there. Get a two-slot refinery in there, and it will create wheels for you automatically. And that's just freaking amazing. That's just insane. Ah, I love this game so much and it's starting to get better and better every freaking update. So yeah, let's wrap up the episode here guys. We've done a lot today or at least, yeah, well not in the episode itself. But I just want to do it this way because then we um, get up with the first season faster. So I'll be doing, well, some gameplay in between which I will not be recording. But then once I start recording I will update you guys with what I did, what I've done and what I'm going to do. And I want to just to focus on everything. Like, I do not want to do one episode with building alone or with a gr a grinding alone or with gathering alone. Or I just want to do everything a bit in each and every episode. So you guys won't get any dull moments in there. Or at least I hope you won't get those. Um, so for now, thank you for watching. And I hope to see you on my next adventure. So... Um Back. But guys, are you ready? I'm not. But I hope you guys are. There we go. <laughs> this thing is a beast. Six point Go Framer, where are you? There you are. Go Framer! Oh, we completely screwed them over. Silver ore. And ironing it. Cool. Pick it up.